3rd January 2023. Grand Emperor Hotel Casino to remain under SJM license until end 2025. SJM Holdings continues to run the casino at Grand Emperor Hotel for another three years after its gaming concession holder. SJM Resorts entered a new service agreement with the operator of the hotel situated in downtown Macau on December 30, 2022. According to a filing to the Stock Exchange of Hong Kong two days ago, Tin Ho, a unit indirectly wholly owned by Emperor Entertainment Hotel, inked the contract with SJM Resorts last Friday, effectively extending a half a year partnership that keeps the satellite casino running from January 1, 2023 to December 31, 2025 under SJM's license. Last April, Emperor Entertainment Hotel announced that it would cease the gaming operation under SJM's concession. However, about two months later, it made another announcement that the gaming operator would continue to run it for another six months. Tin Ho is entitled to a monthly share, or a service fee, of the satellite casino's gross gaming revenue under the agreement, which is subject to what the filing describes as an annual cap. The cap for the first three months of the year is set at 100 million Hong Kong dollars. It rises to 400 million Hong Kong dollars for the financial year ending March 31, 2024, then to 600 million Hong Kong dollars for the financial year ending March 31, 2025, before arriving at 700 million Hong Kong dollars for the last nine months of the partnership. Previously, the Tin Ho took in 209 million Hong Kong dollars in service fees in the 12 months ending March 31, 2021. 261 million Hong Kong dollars in the 12 month period in 2022, and 24 million Hong Kong dollars from April 1, 2022 to June 26, 2022. Under the existing three year service agreement, which takes 21 days' notice to end, Tin Ho is responsible for all operating costs and expenses of the gaming area in return. The gaming area of Emperor E Hotel and Grand Emperor Hotel had been operated under the gaming concession held by SJM. Due to the outbreak of COVID-19 pandemic in early 2020, the Emperor E Hotel Group has faced the most difficult time since its commencement of gaming business and incurred a loss for the first time in the six months ended September 30, 2020, said the group. The Emperor E Hotel Group's management considered it was in the best interest of the Emperor E Hotel Group not to renew the service agreement with SJM upon its expiration on June 26, 2022, and instead, to receive a relatively steady monthly income from SJM for the provision of hotel rooms, catering and other ancillary services to SJM for the period from June 27, 2022 to December 31, 2022 during when the gaming operation and Grand Emperor Hotel are being run by SJM. Emperor Entertainment Hotel announced in November last year that the group's net loss increased by 85.4% to 155.7 million Hong Kong dollars year-on-year for the six months ending September 30, 2022 as a result of the cessation of gaming operations since mid-year. This news is brought to you by M Plus Live and Macau News Agency. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And follow us on Facebook.